Hi friends! I'm so excited for today's video because it is a fashion haul. I haven't done one of these videos in a while and I really don't know why because they're one of my favorite videos to film because I love everything style and fashion. So today we're going to present some items that I picked out from ASOS and H&M and we have a lot of stuff to go through and I also want to do a try on haul in this video for you guys so we're gonna get right into it so make sure to thumbs up this video if you like fashion hauls and also make sure to hit that notification button so that you can get notifications of new videos posted all right so let's get right into the haul all right so the first thing I'm going to show you guys is the top from ASOS it is this really pretty peachy, like rose gold color top. Now, I have to be honest and say that I thought that it was going to be a lot more silkier than this material. As silky, like satiny as I thought it was going to be. But I do love the color. I do really love the collar here. Um, it's very nice. It's a little oversized and I got it in a size small. Next thing that I got from ASOS is from Pretty Little Thing and it's this really cute bodysuit as you guys can see. It has the corset detail here in the front and it has a see-through uh, mesh sleeve that's kind of like bunched up here. I really liked it on the site. It looks really pretty. I got it in a size 6. So we will see how that fits me. I don't have the price. Of course, there isn't a price on the tag. But I will post it down below for you guys. I think it was about $40. So yeah, and then it like right here near the uh, string, it has a really nice like velvety uh, detail right there. So I thought this top looked really cute. So we will see how this one looks the last thing that I got from ASOS was some shoes. I'm really excited. They are a pair of mules. Uh, one of my favorite fashion bloggers, uh, the pecking order, she got them as well. The mule has a middle strap here, a nice soft suede uh, detailing on the shoe. But what I really loved was the heel. It has a nice shiny silver chrome heel these i'm really excited about they were super affordable because they are the asos brand and i got them in a size seven so i'm really excited to style these for you guys so this was my last pick from asos the big one is h&m yes all right so the first thing is this round ring handle bag i was like really excited to order this bag it was so affordable for the well will look like the quality we'll see it has a nice gold ring detail here in the front it's got a little bit of a suede detail here on the bag and the rest is this nice brown probably faux leather detail here with some gold button details on the side I really like this bag because it's multifunctional because you can carry it like this or you can do it with the straps. So let me see. See how cute? Yes, let's see if you can even do it this way. Yeah, so this is a really cute bag. Well, these things don't come with prices anymore. Then I got my first ever beret. This is a wool blend beret. It's in the color white. I don't know if I'll keep this. I don't know if the shape of my head will look good with berets. I'm not sure. I look like a chef. I've never worn a beret before, so I gotta figure out how to put this on. So yeah, I got this beret. I, I know it was pretty cheap. Of course, it doesn't have the price on it, but I wanted to try it out. If I don't like it, I'll just take it back. All right, the next thing is the sweater. I was really excited for this sweater. The sweater looked really nice. Ooh, it looks kind of small though I mean it is a small but it looks really really small I don't know if I'm gonna fit this but it's this off-the-shoulder button detail sweater um, it looked really cute on the model online it's supposed to kind of come off the shoulders like this uh, obviously it would, I would have to wear them with high-waisted pants because it looks really short 
Um, so we will see how this looks on me. All right, I was really excited about this shirt. It is a Friends shirt, the TV show Friends. Let's see. I got it in a size small. So cute with like a blazer. Very cash, very fun. If you're going out for brunch, going just run some errands. This is really cute. I'm excited for this shirt. I know this shirt was like super affordable. That's why I bought it. Did I actually pick out this blazer? All right, next is a blazer. I don't really own a lot of solid color blazers, and I definitely don't have a solid color brown one. So nice uh, black button detail here. It has, let's see if they're real pockets now. They're fake pockets, they're not real pockets. So it has no pockets. But it does have the big shoulder pads here. So I just thought it had like a nice menswear blazer look which I kind of like those even though I'm petite I do like some like really nice over the size blazer looks so I got this one in this and I got it in a size four on the blazers because there's not an H&M here where I live which is shocking I know um there are so many things that I wanted to try out but you know everything fits differently in H&M so I just ordered a whole bunch of stuff to see how it'll fit but yeah, I was really excited for this houndstooth pattern uh, blazer. Size four as well. This one actually has pockets, real pockets, which is nice. Okay, so this was like my favorite blazer that I picked out because of the colors. Really excited. Again, I stayed with the size four, but I love the colors. You guys see these colors you've got orange and blue and light blue and white and brown i just thought the colors were going to be so fun to wear in the spring especially with that brown bag and that white beret i was thinking oh my god it's gonna look so cute these are a pair of pants i think i'm pretty sure these were like 17.99 oh the material is a lot Ooh. Material is not the material that I thought it was going to be, but I should have figured by the price. Um, it's 100% polyester, and of course they don't have a price on it. These would look really cute with a pair of sneakers for like a really nice casual look. I'm trying to buy more pants that are not jeans. Um, more like really fun patterns like this that I can also wear with sneakers. So um, they looked cute on the site, so we'll see how they look on. Again, there's no pockets. I don't know why I thought there was pockets, but there's no pockets on these pants. So yes, that's everything. So let's try it on and let's get into what it looks like on. All right, so here is the ASOS top. As you can see, my bra is showing here. So that's... And no, so I'd have to probably wear it with no bra and just use a little bit of tape. I had the intention of wearing it like tucked in in my mind. I don't know. I just don't know about this big opening part. I mean, I love the color. I think the color is really nice. But I don't know about this. If I could just get this situated. I mean, it's a really cute, I mean, it's a really cute top. I just don't know if I can live with this. I mean, I could wear like a nice lacy bralette and have it show like peekaboo style for like a little bit of detail with some nice layered necklaces. I don't know. What do you guys think? Should I return it? Should I exchange it? Should I keep it? All right, guys, so here is the Pretty Little Thing corset. It's very, I love the sleeves. It's very, very sexy and fun. I don't know if a size six fits me. I mean, it feels good in this part when you wear a bodysuit. Ladies, you know what I'm talking about. I don't know if up here, like if this part looks a little 
a little big on me. This is the back. All right, guys, so here is the off-the-shoulder H&M sweater. It's cute. It's very short, as you can see. So I don't know if a size small is my size, if I should have gotten it a medium. It's If I bend over, it, like, comes up here in the back, so I don't know. And these are pretty high-waisted jeans that I put on, probably the most high-waisted ones that I have. So... I don't know. I mean, it is really cute. I put it with some like white boots and it looks really cute as an outfit. No, about the length. I'm nervous that if I wash it, it's going to shrink up even smaller and I'm not going to wear it again. An outfit though, it looks really, really cute. I love it with the jeans. I love it with the boots. It looks really cool. Here we have the Friends t-shirt. Very cute. I really, really love the t-shirt. And then this is the black and white houndstooth blazer. I don't know if I'm crazy about the blazer. I don't know if I'm crazy about the way it kind of cuts here and it kind of comes out. It's not really like nice and tailored to my body. See, this is bothering me like crazy. Um, I do like the fact that it has pockets, but I feel like the pockets gives it this extra weight at the bottom that's not flattering to my frame or the way that I like to wear blazers. But it's a nice material. It's It feels pretty thick. It's not too thin. I do love the print, but I'm not sure if I love the way it just cuts at the bottom. And I love it with the white boots, though. That is super cute, but I don't know. It kind of has this this weird thing right here. I don't know. I don't know what in the world that is, but I just oh, I love the print of this blazer so much. It's so fun for spring, transitioning from winter to spring. I think this would be great. Guys, this is, none of them is like, no outfit so far has been like a home run. Everything's kind of like, eh. And I don't like to keep things that I'm eh about. I'm trying to like Marie Kondo my life. So if you don't spark me joy automatically, do I really need to keep you? Probably not. So I don't know. All right, this is the last and final blazer. Again, I really love the color. It's not something that I have in my closet. I do like this one. It's just not as fun as the other one. The other one was really fun with all the colors and the prints. This one is very solid, but it is nice. It is a nice basic blazer to have. It's a very nice soft material. It feels nice quality. I don't know. I do like the lapels here. What do you guys think? Do we like it? Do we love it? Are we meh about it? Alright, so here it is with the bag. Super cute. I mean, I do kind of like this outfit. This would be really fun for brunch. I'm wearing a blazer. I have to, like... It's like automatic. My hand goes in a pocket. It's like I'm ready to take a picture all the time. Okay, guys. So this is our last and final look for today. These are the pants from H&M. These are in a size 4. And they feel a little big. I guess I could have got a size 2. But I... Is this a size 4? Yeah. It's a, it is a size 4. I guess I could have got a size 2, but I just did not feel comfortable ordering a size 2. But the length is okay. It doesn't... I don't know. I don't like these pants at all. I like the idea of these pants. I like the print of these pants. But I don't like them at all. I really would have preferred pockets. They're super, super thin. So there's no way I can wear them from now until probably May. Because it's just too cold. I will feel every chilling breeze 
all over my body down here. Oh, I liked the idea of this outfit. It was so cute in my head and it just didn't deliver in person. The more I wear the blazer, I'm kind of loving it. I feel like with a pair of sunglasses, it'll look super cool. Pants are enough. All right, so that's everything, you guys. Don't forget that I'm going to include links to each item down below. If I don't find it, I'll try to find something similar for you guys because as your friend, I love going shopping for my friends. So if I can't find what it is that I purchase, I'll try to find something similar for you guys. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate uh, you guys taking the time to watch my channel. Have a blessed day and mwah! I'll see you in the next one. Bye.